So Libra, it's the 30th of July. I'm going to do your reading because I'm absolutely so late. For the next seven days, Angel, Spirit, Guides, Universe, Libra, from the 30th of July, what would you like Libra to know? What's the guidance for Libra this week? What's the guidance for Libra? What's the guidance for Libra for this week of the 30th of July for the next seven days? The next seven days for Libra, please. Angels, Spirit, Guides, Libra, 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 what would you like Libra to know? Would you like Libra to know about the next seven days? Angels, spirit, guides, universe. What would you like Libra to know? <clears throat> what are the energies for Libra this week? The 30th. Libra. What would you like Libra to know? Okay. Okay, Libra. On the bottom of the deck, we have the magician. You can have anything you want. When you've got the magician, you have to manifest it. But you can... You can make things go up or down. So I'm just looking at the colour of the room. It's just gone blue for some, for some reason. I don't know why. So let's just go with it. Um, so the, it's about the pen. It's about writing things down. Um, you know, make a list of all the things that you're going to be in at the end of the tunnel. So at the, at the end of the road, you can pick up any tool at your disposal. It's your strength of will. You can always will something to happen. Um, so you've got the five of pentacles. You could feel left out in the cold. You could be paying off some debt and trying to keep all the juggle all the balls in the air at the moment. You could have been dealing with two people, making the choice, uh, also starting a new business. Uh, but you've got out of some kind of third party trap. The swords, the overwhelm is out. Um, it's like you've chosen what you wanted to do. There's no more of sneaking around if this is you or someone else. Um, and you've mastered yourself. This is pretty simple for me to see here because I've got the nine upright, nine of pentacles. So it's like you've mastered your independence. You are feeling like you want to travel places. There's a bit of money here. Uh, people are going to say how... Did you have this glow up? And it's like I've worked really hard to get here. This is all that I'm gifted. This is my gift. So that's what I'm using. Um, it's like you're just done with anything that's seedy. It's like you're getting rid of some mental worries. You're choosing what you want in love or in for yourself, really. Um, it's, you're putting your gas mask on first, which is the five of pentacles. There's some kind of discrepancy. You're not seeing eye to eye with a soulmate, uh, but you are nostalgic. You are thinking about the past and the things that you love and kids and memories. Uh, someone from the past could be coming back towards you this week or you to them um, because you're not seeing eye to eye. It's like... It's like, I know what I want now. Because I'm looking at the seven upside down. So it's like, she's saying, well, choose what you want. You can live with this person. You're going to marry them. And it's like, upside down, it's almost like you've chosen one of your options. So that you're no longer sneaking around in, with the seven in reverse. So, but then it goes, the seven would go back to, seven verse would go back to the six of cups upright. She's sitting on that rock, wishing this person would come back because she realises um, she made a mistake. So regardless of whether what you're doing, this I think this love option that you've taken, you've chosen it and it's new. It's a brand new thing. It's a brand new feeling of love. There's something new that you're choosing here or you've chosen who you want and how. Or this is another offer of love and it's coming in. This person will have your back. This person wants to talk to you a lot. There's lots of talking or you're going to have someone's back. You just realise this is what I want and I need to go and get it. Um, it could be with someone. It could be with a Gemini. Um, this could also be an uprush of feeling to just go into battle with somebody that's got your back. It's like you can trust this person They're, or this person's coming in towards you with this offer of this new love and they really want, want to talk. Um, it might... See, the Knight of Swords goes to start a war. They're the twins, they're the Gemini. It's on a moving horse. So he's, he's the messenger, he's the heir. So they go in and say, "There's gonna. this is war to the front line, you know, and it's like charge. And... Uh, 
it means something in your life needs to be shaken up. There needs to be something. So start it action or, or words at least to start something up. Um, let's ask the romance angels what they would like. So it seems you've got to pay off some debt somewhere. Um, but you're starting to make the decision to get out of a trap mentally to not have so many options or, or you haven't got that many options but you don't you don't want to sneak around anymore no one's deceiving you there's no deceit no worry uh, you've mastered um yourself um you're not seeing eye to eye with a soulmate but you are reminiscing and either you're going to offer this new love or someone's coming in new to tell you something about new love these ones fell out what have we got here we've got Calling in your soul way, your prayers, affirmations and visualisations help bring you together. You deserve love. You are lovable. You've got true love. You, this is the romance of a lifetime and honeymoon. Enjoy the bliss of holiday time together. So maybe you're going away with someone or someone's going to tell you they want to take you away. Um, let's ask the angels, what would they like? Libra, no, Angel Spirit Guides, Libra, please. What would you like Libra to know? I don't know what the colours are doing. Angel Spirit Guides, Libra, please. What would you like Libra to know? Maybe you're feeling blue, Libra. But this is usually a pink room. Now we're blue. Angel Spirit Guides, what would you like Libra to know about this week of the 30th of... We could have 30th of July, Libra, please, Libra, Libra, Libra. What would you like Libra to know about this week of the 30th of July? Okay. When you take excellent care of yourself, look how blue that card, this is blue card. When you take excellent care of yourself, everybody benefits. Give your relation, give yourself a relaxing treat today, such as a massage, sea salt bath or pedicure. I knew it would be blue. I knew the card would be blue, another blue card. So this is why we're blue. It's the uh, throat chakra. You've got to express yourself vocally. And I think right at the end of the week, that's what you're going to be doing. You are a light worker. God needs you to shine your divine light and love like an angel upon the earth and all of its inhabitants. So you're going to have to get ready. There's something you might be going traveling with someone. It's saying you deserve love. There's love coming in. <clears throat> There's an offer of this new, it could be a new home even. Give me one more card for Libra, please. Libra. Libra. We've got Daniel. I'm the angel of marriage and I'm assisting you right now. And then another blue card. That's a green card. But the other blue card is you're flying high right now, which may threaten others. Don't descend because others will soon become inspired by your example angels what is the person that libra's thinking about most on their mind what is the truth they'd like to tell libra the person most on libra's mind what would they like to tell libra i wish i'd treated you better the person most on libra's mind my life is not as together as it seems just being near you is intoxicating and one more please for libra what's the person most on libra's mind what would they like to tell libra I can't stop thinking about you. Someone's going to come in and tell you they're going to offer this. It, this is true love. They want to come in. They want to come in and tell you they love you. That's what I can see. Libra, you can manifest anything. Oh my God, Libra, under the Ge under the Gemini, I want to say. This is Virgo Gemini and the Gemini here. It could be Gemini or Pisces you're dealing with. There's a wish coming true this week or next, just going into the next week. Um, just being near you is intoxicating. Someone regrets what they said or did. They want to marry you. Don't descend. Look after yourself. Be a light worker. Um, look after your health a lot this week. And... Um, there's definitely a decision of something's coming into fruition in the love realm, at least conversation. Um, take care, Libra, and I'll speak to you soon. Bye-bye.